Hola! Oops, always keep fighting is on the wrong side. I'm like all decked out and always keep fighting, always keep fighting, always keep fighting. And I was wearing an always keep fighting shirt all day today and I wore another one to work out. Okay, so I am so proud of myself. I've been telling myself to make videos for the last three months, truthfully the last year. So I've been telling myself to make videos for the last year and I finally did it. I just flat out just shot three videos in a row. Actually, the last one, I went on so many tangents that I think I actually have two videos. <laughs> next to the plug that's next to my bed. It's in a really weird spot on the wall. So like I can use it, but it's like, like can you even see that? Like it's right here. <laughs> like this is how I have to use this plug. <gasps> I did it. Is it all the way in? Can you charge now? Yay! Okay. Totally normal. People eat lettuce like this, right? The goal for the day was to do a bunch of things. I didn't do all of them. I did a lot of them. And I'm super proud of myself. So, you see these things here. Let me turn this off. Um, these are all things that I need to get done. I need to finish up my new resume. This is just get a job. And then I have a whole bunch of clothes for when I was 100 pounds heavier that I need to, well, almost 100 pounds heavier, like 95 pounds heavier, that I need to um, sell. These are things to do with my current job. This is my demo reel for voiceovers. I have to edit that and then I have to send it to people. Um, this is YouTube stuff. So it's literally just like I shot videos, which was this one. I ripped it off already because I shot those videos, which I'm super proud of myself for. Yee! Um, and this is, this is just telling myself to edit those videos and then shoot more and then edit more, which I probably can do later on this week. And then this is just prepare for my audition, which I have the things to do that. Oh, I need to tape these up on the wall. Um, so these are my audition thingies. So I've got to not memorize, but familiarize myself with the words. It's a teleprompter audition. So they want you to read it off there. So if you're like fake reading it because you memorize the whole thing, you can tell. They want you to be able to like fully do it. So that's prepare for audition right here. So um, hopefully by the time I go to sleep, that one's ripped off. And this just says I need an oil change for my car, which I was hoping to get today. But I did a bunch of other stuff that I'm really proud of. So I'm glad I, so I'm actually glad that I skipped that, but I need to get to it soon because my car will die. So the lettuce is gonna help me get to that goal tomorrow, even though it's kind of late. Um, it's like 8, 8.30, which normally by now I'd be done eating, except I think I'm gonna go to sleep today at like 11, and if I go to sleep at 11, then I'll wake up at like 7, and I'll be able to wake up, work out, before leaving at like 9.30 for my audition, even though that would make me super early, but I'd rather be super late, or super early than super late. So my room is a mess. It's totally a mess because I do not have money to do the things that I need to do. For all of for all of the things, the places that I need to put these things don't exist. Like there should be shelves on this wall and on this wall and that would hold all of this stuff. So if all these jobs pan out, if all these things, the resume, the acting jobs, if all that stuff happens, I'll be able to pay rent and get all the things that I need to get to here to get organized because I actually hate how disorganized it is, but I'm gonna do it. Bye. <laughs> Good morning. So I just weighed myself. I weigh myself every morning and I am down another pound, but I was hoping to be down two pounds this morning because I know most of it was just water weight, but I haven't released it yet. Hopefully tomorrow. So new development. I just shot a video wearing this shirt and I just reopened like the tag on it because we were supposed to write our names on it and I don't know why I just looked at it. But this tag says someone who was in my, like my middle school class. Like it says Raphael which is not Chengu Carbo. It's not actually my name, but I remember this kid. He was cool. Uh, well, no, he could be a bully. He grew into a bully. He was really cool until he became friends with some popular kids. Anyway, so maybe I should be glad I stole a shirt because I have no recollection until this moment that that says anything other than Chengu Carbo. <laughs> so apparently middle school Chengu was a bit of a klepto. Who knew? <laughs> I had no idea that I stole this. Where's mine? I want mine now. 
I mean, this one kind of looks cool, but I'm sure mine looked better because of the, I'm kidding. So I'm back from my audition. As you can tell, I did some more work on organizing my area. My resume, new resume is almost done. That is the way that I am today because I was, I, it's 168. I was 165 my birthday, which was like 10, 11 days ago. And then I was 160, and then I got up to like 172 um, because of period bloating and cake. Um, and <laughs> I'm back down now to 168. It actually was 167 this morning, but that was only after working out. So I'm counting like my morning weight, not my morning after working out weight. Yeah, so today was a good day. That audition was awesome. I felt good after. I don't know whether or not they will feel good about it. I hope so. I hope they like it and I hope that they choose me, of course, because it's me. Of course, I would want to be chosen. But yeah, right now I'm just finishing up that resume and then I'm gonna send it out a little bit and then I have some editing to do because I have to finish up my first video that's gonna go up tomorrow. Hopefully I get it up tomorrow and hopefully I'm not like a like I was last time and ended up not having things up on the day when I said I was gonna have them up. I don't wanna do that anymore. I want to have things up when I say. To be a woman of my word because I'm not being super lazy. Okay, now I have to go back to work because it is 5.30 and I need to finish this resume and like three other things before I can call it quits um, because I need to go to sleep at 11 tonight just to, because I decided that that's gonna be my time. Like, like I could stay up all night, but I decided that I'm not going to be up all night anymore. I'm not doing that because that's contributing to my anxiety in the morning when my whole brain is screaming that I should be up and working on something when in fact I've only had three hours of sleep. So anxiety. So I'm working towards the concept of taking care of myself and that starts with going to bed at a reasonable time so that when I wake up, I'll be like, oh, I had eight hours of sleep. So when it's seven o'clock in the morning, and my brain's like, time to get up, you have to work. It's like, no, I can get up, it's okay. I'll still lose weight because that's the part that's weight that's, that's freaking out because if my body doesn't have eight hours of sleep then I know that I won't go down on my weight. And I'm like, but I won't lose weight unless I sleep till 11. But my brain's like, but you're supposed to be working at seven o'clock, other people are up, people want to do things and you should be there 100% working. So um, so that's like the, the conflict that I go through every single morning. So I'm trying to like go to sleep earlier and just kind of take care of myself. So I know that this is a trigger for me. So I'm doing what I can to take care of it. So, all right, back to work. 